did that for her son. She took me to the place of darkness and sacrifices. And I vowed to become a beggar for the rest of my life so that my children will become rich. And that the spirits will drink from the water and blood of my sweat. I vowed that I will never eat from the comfort of the sacrifices that I have been doing for my children to become rich. I am the hen of sacrifice. Now, you know. The misfortune that befell you when I came dwelling in your house. I slept in that soft mattress and the air conditioning cooling my skin. I know it the spirits because they felt I was eaten from the comfort of your money even though I did not eat food in your house the spirits still took away all that they gave to you but when I went back to the streets as the beggar Everything they took from you was returned back. The good health, the money, the long life, the child, and the contracts. You all got them back. Oh! 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 Hey! Angie, wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Angie! Wake up! Everything will be fine. Just relax. No, no, I can't stay here. I can't stay here. I can't stay here. Did you just... Did you hear what Mama said today? Did you just hear what she said? All the money you've been making was as a result of her sacrifice. Did you hear it? Yes. We're all in this together. No. I understand how you feel. No, I have to go. No. Relax. No, Let's I can't... Solution. Relax? Yes. I can't relax. I can't stay in this house. I can't. What? Relax. What are you saying? Angie, baby, calm down, okay? Please calm down. <sighs> we must find a way out of this. Please. Ngozi, please. I beg you. Just be calm. We all know that what Mama did was wrong. Nobody is happy about what she did. But please, we haven't died yet. And nobody would die now that we know the truth. I beg you. Yes, now we know the truth. Like you said, we have to go. Calm down. We have to go. We know that the truth. Baby, can you calm down? What are you talking about? Listen, I understand how you feel. <laughs> but trust me, let's calm down and look for solution. No, we can't look for any solution, Alex. You and this house is stained already. Are you aware? I beg you. We need to go. We need to go. It is nobody's fault. It's not your fault. It's not my fault either. Please calm down. What are you saying? Do you understand what you're saying? Yes, we do. Because <laughs> please. 
think I'm my brother because I don't, I don't want anything to happen to my only brother. I thank you. Listen, don't do this to my brother. Nothing will happen to your brother, all right? What are you talking about? Are you even saying? As for me, I am meeting the same right now. Please, oh, no. No. Oh, please, don't, please don't do this to my brother. Oh. Don't allow her to go. Don't allow her to go, please. Don't allow her to go. Papa, oh, Papa's killed us. Don't let her go! Oh, 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 Mama! It's okay. It's okay. Mama's killed us! Angie, Angie, baby, listen. Angie, please, don't do this. I mean, think of what people will say when they see you like this. You are giving them more reason to call me a ritualist. At least take your car. Take my car? Yes. Take this car that you purchased with your mother's sacrifice money? Of course I can't do that. I can't be part of this. So, excuse me, are you, are you going to leave me because of what my mother did? Is it my fault that she did what she did? I'm also a victim here. Please, don't do this. Please. <laughs> oh. You're also a victim, right? You are, right? Okay, fine. Abandon this house, huh? And everything that you have purchased with the sacrifice money for the last two years. Are you serious? Yes. Abandon it. And I will know truly that you are a victim. I will know and relinquish all the comfort your mother bestowed on you with the sacrifice money. Then I will truly believe you that you're a victim of circumstances and not of and not part of the whole thing. NG baby, are you telling me to go back to square one because of what my mother did? I should go back to poverty because of my mother's mistake. Even if I will, it's not a decision I will take here and now. I need time. Fine. Then wait. You can stay in this house. As for me, I'm leaving right now. I will only come back when you are clean. As for now, I am no more interested till you come clean. I will not be part of this, all right? I will not leave in this sacrifice house. I will not do it. A good woman should stand by her husband in times of trouble. And I refuse to be that good woman. Jesus is Lord. Alex, do you understand me? I refuse to be her. If you like, stay here. I am done with this, all right? You can stay with this dirty money. Rituals money, blood money. I have nothing to do with it. Right? Bye, Alex. Give me your way. Oh, 
Ngozi! Ngozi! I'm talking to you. I've been thinking. Could it be that I didn't know what I was doing when I got married to you? I got married to you two years ago, right? And from my calculations, your mother has gone to do that nonsense she did. And now how am I sure that it wasn't what she did that brought me to you, blinded me and made me marry you? What is that for? Are you now a snake? Which one is... What is wrong with you? Are you even sure that I know what I'm doing right now? Andy. Andy, don't even try it. Did you hear me? You are sick and you need a doctor. You need a doctor and a real doctor at that. Not that silly juju you, your mom went to meet. In the name of God. Enough. My day has already been ruined and I don't want you to add more to it. Please. Come on, babe. That's not the plan. Just calm down. But after hearing all that from your mom, what do you expect me to think? At least I'm a guy now. How sure am I that everything I've been doing and even marrying you was with my clear eyes? How am I even sure that I'm not being manipulated by one juju somewhere? One small pot! Maybe calling my name every day. Andy jump, I will jump. Andy move, I will move. Andy go to bed, I will go to bed. Andy, mm, mm, I will mm, mm, every day. No, tell me. Enjoy the room. Where are you going to? Since you want to stay here. Where are you going to? I'm going. If I don't have any other place to go to, I rather go to the kitchen than to stay here and listen to the nonsense that is coming out from your mouth instead of you to be looking for solution. Madam, you better come here. Go will not solve the situation at all. No. Come and be sure that this is still me because I'm confused right now. What is happening? What if I didn't know when I got married to her? Mama, my world has left me. My soulmate, my companion, NG baby has left me. My wife is gone, and it's all your fault, Mama. Are you happy now? Do you love your wife or poverty? I can recant the vow. I will assure you that. Everything that you own will be taken away from you less than two weeks. You will toil, sweat and blood before you will eat. You will no longer be the man that you are today because you won't even know where the next meal is coming from. Your wife will come back. But can she love you without money? Can she love you without the beauty of a man in your pocket? Mama. Recant the vow. I cannot be feeding on the blood of my own mother. Go back there. Go back to where you were cursed and uncursed yourself. Tell them you're no longer interested. How could you? That was a huge sacrifice. Go back there and unsay whatever you said. Let my true destiny speak for me. How could you? How could you take such decision without my consent? Mama, denounce them. Denounce them. I will stand under the shelter of my destiny. Let heavens fall. Trust me, I will not resist. How could you? How could you? How could you? Make it up, Wajay. Make it up, Wajay. How could you? 
I won't get speed to that. Disappointed in you. Hey. Have you forgotten you are talking about your own mother? Mm -mm. I know it's our mother we are talking about. And that is why I am telling you that Mama will not do that. Mama did not die since we did not know. For two years. Is it now she's going to die? Alex! How do you feel comfortable sleeping at night, knowing fully well that your mother is sleeping in the dustbin? Did she tell you she's sleeping in the dustbin? Did she tell you she made this choice for herself? She did. After all, Christ did the same. Christ died for Christians. Oboria, allow Mama to carry her cross. You have no bear. Ego ye bugi. Ego ye bugi. Ego ye bugi. Poverty wogi. Ego ye bugi. Poverty ye bugi. You have sold your soul because of money. Yes, poverty wogi. You want Mama to remain poor because Alex, of money. Alex, poverty. Okay. Poverty will kill you. Okay. If you let me, you should be ashamed of yourself. Others are there making money. You are here saying blah 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 blah. No answer. Let me not see you here. Bring my bag, Regina. Where are you? Please get give my bag. Let me go and meet my mother. Let me see what Alex can do. Idiot! Let me see in my shop again. I will arrest you. Eh? I will arrest you. You're very stupid. You're, 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 you're an the animal. You're one that is stupid. You're because a fool. You, I, I will slap you. You're I will, not I will an animal. Get out! Mama, Mama, in stupid affair. man. In our fair. In affair. In affair. Eh? Have you seen it? Mama. Have you seen what you got? What cost? is that here that you want to go and do? Eh? Don't even try it. Don't try it. Did you hear me? In why am I? As who? No, 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 as who? As I don't know, I don't know. I don't know. That is what I okay, am. Okay, I'm yes. my nephew. Because no, no, you're no. not making sense. No, no. Mama, Mama, you will denounce that nonsense and what that's fine. Alex, it's a lie. Over my dead body. You want to be living on your own mother's blood? Which blood? Which blood? You want to be living on your own mother's Which blood? Which blood? Mm. Eh? Alex. You should be ashamed of yourself. It's because they want to be a job at go. Yeah? That is why you cannot make money. No, 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 go no, no, and no. make money. You are just desperate because if you are not desperate, you wouldn't be talking like this. See you. You want to be feeding on your mother's blood. Who is sitting on her blood? On your mother's He's blood. You know that is sitting on her blood. Mama, you are just try you are desperate for money. You are desperate Mama, for money. I will show you. Don't even try it. Unless you're very, very stupid. And if anything happens to Mama, it's you that I will hold responsible. Listen, 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 listen. This conversation is deeper than you. You are not even, you don't have say here. Eh. What, you're not making sense. Who are you? Mm. What you are saying is nonsense. Eh. You cannot be feeding on your own mother's blood. So you can retire seven poor. Alex, who made you that? Who gave you that authority? Who do you think you are, Alex? Who the hell do you think you are, Alex? I will slap you. Imam Mugi hundred. Imam Mugi hundred. You think I know that Mugi will get ten thousand? That is what I will give you. Mama, you are the cause of all this. You will denounce that nonsense. Never. Are you getting me? I cannot be enjoying, and my mother will be suffering. Never. You can't reach your mother. Alex, never. Mama, in my family, I want. Don't even try it. It try, I try. We work it out more about that game. Okay. In Nigeria, we work it. Alex, you are a fool. You are very stupid though. You are enjoying you're which money? Stupid. Your mother is blonde. Alex, you are the one that is stupid. Is this Alex, enjoy, man? That's my way. I will show you. Ma, 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 I'm not going to say that. Just do it. If I slap you, you will change your mind. You don't have mind to be funny. You are talking. This is what you've got. You are crying now. This is what you've got. No, no. My younger sister is not talking to me anyhow. Do you see it? In our speed. In our speed. Have you seen what you've got? What's the most stupid sacrifice is this? What's the most stupid sacrifice is this? I'm enjoying it more. My mom is suffering. Does that make sense? Don't get, get, get. <laughs> Babe, your mother made a mistake. And we must not encourage her to continue. She has done enough harm already. Even though she thought she was doing it for the good of both of you. Imagine the scenario now. A situation where a man like me is now doubting if I actually married him with my clear eyes. It's a terrible situation. So terrible, my dear. Andy, wait. Are you... Are you serious? 
saying my mom charmed you into marrying me. No, come on. That's not what I'm saying. Then what are you saying? No, come to think of it. It's, it's also possible. It is possible. Considering where we all are now. Did you hear what she said? It is possible. Fine. Divorce me. Divorce me and come back when your eyes are cleared. Come on, girl. That's not what I'm saying. Free your mother. Stop standing in her way. Else she'll be contending with your own destiny. Yo. Eh? So you're supporting Alex? You're supporting Alex for us to go back to being poor? Is that what you're saying? That's not what I'm saying. That is not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is, look around you. Did all the rich people you see do what your mother did to become rich? Did they do Everybody it? has their own secret. Yes. Oh, everybody has their own secret. Yes. So can you do that? Can you do that to your children? I don't understand. Can you do exactly what your mom did to your children? My name is Nena, not Ogazi. There you go again. There you go again. Do unto others what you want them to do unto you. Can you hear that? Whatever you sow in life is what you will reap. That is the surest and most golden rule ever. If you sow good, you reap good. You sow evil, you reap evil. And your husband, I want us to sow good so that we can reap good. What is hard in that? What is good in what you're sowing? Tell me what is good in this thing you're saying now. So you're trying to say that I should lose my madam, madam de madam. Anywhere I go to, they will call me Nenna de Madame de Madame. Eh? I should stop answering Madame and start answering Nenna. Okay? Eh? All my workers, everything I enjoy. What are you even saying? Please, I beg you. If you don't have anything important to say, close your mouth. Even as you are talking now, I know there's this still small voice telling you the truth. Telling you to free your mother. You think that thing she's living his life? She's dying gradually. Hey, so you are saying that I should lose my trip to Istanbul? My customers, Madame de Madame, everything that I have. Oh, all of you, you guys have gone mad. You have gone mad. It will never, never, I will not allow that to happen. I will never. You know what? I think at this point I've said enough. Alright? okay. I'm one woman in water. If you have ears, just listen to what I'm telling you before it's too late. Allow that woman gain her freedom. It's just that simple. I'm done talking. Your children must not spend a penny from the money we gave them. They must not even wear clothes from the money we gave them. Tell your daughter to close her shop and everything that gives her money at this time. Tell your son to sell his house and put the money into this river. After listening to everybody's trouble, which has been caused by what I said and my decision to recant my vow to Idigo and the air people to be poor for the two of you to be rich, I have decided to go ahead and put an end to it. So, Mama, where does that lead, leave the both of us? Where our real and correct destiny was taking us to. <sighs> but they say men are the authors of their own destiny. Sometimes we take risks, we do something. Not in a situation like this, Nenna. We have gone beyond that point. Let Mama recant her vows. Let heaven fall. I'm hmm. waiting. Hey. Hmm. 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 Brother, hope when this heaven falls, you will not run away. He will not run. We will not run. We will wait to see heaven when it falls. We will all go to heaven and enjoy. <laughs> okay. 
Oye. Afo. Mkwa. Wind from the east, take this. Wind from the west, take this. Wind from the south, take this. Wind from the west, take this. I have given you all your properties. Leave me alone. Take everything that you have given to me and make me to become myself again. That is all I want. Ah. Mm. You have seen everything inside the house? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, including this car. This car is part of the deal. Uh, do you like this one? Mm. Yeah. Look around. All the ACs are new. All the ACs are new. Brown new. Brown new conditions. Oh. Yes. So if you want this car too, Fine. Oh wow. Including this one. I think this will be good for the kids to go to school. Yeah. Yeah. And that one too? Yes, yeah, so. sir. This All one right. too. Yeah. What do you uh, think about that? A good deal? Yeah, let's close the deal. I also have a baby gym down there. Mm -hmm. Everything. That's nice. You like it? Yeah. Deal. Don't we? Let's go close the deal. Yeah.
Take your change. Um, you should listen to me. You should at least listen to me even if you don't agree to what I have to say. You know, a beautiful woman like you shouldn't be selling a restaurant like this. Selling beers, food. You deserve more than this. You deserve a more comfortable life. Think about it. A lady like you should be in Malibu, Venice, eating Dubai, eating and having a good life. And not, not this. You ate food of 3-3 three, three, and you drank a drink of 1,000 Naira. That is 4-3. Your balance with us is 700 Naira. My auntie asked me to come and give you your change, okay? So take your change. I don't need it. I'm only telling you that you deserve more than this and allow me to give you a comfortable life. Allow me to help your future. I said take your change! Which future? Does he? Bia, 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 bia. Alex Nachogi. Was he talking love to you? What did he say to you? He just said... He just said he wanted to take care of me. And I was thinking about everything that we had. And everything we've owned in this life. And I felt so bad. I was hurt by everything. I don't know. I don't know. Everybody is suffering now. Are you regretting our decision? Do you think we should have allowed Mama to continue? When I left, I thought you would not leave. I thought you would stay. But I'm glad that you left. I'm glad you left. You know, I... I actually thought that you wouldn't abandon everything and leave. But you did. When God created us, He didn't create us to suffer. All right? I know for sure someday things are going to be fine. I'll always be your wife. I'll always stand by you, regardless. All right? It's okay. I'm here for you. And I will never leave you. Alright? I promise you. Alright? It's alright. I will never leave you. No matter how hard it gets, I will stick by you. Okay?
All right. What are you doing here? I'm asking you now, what are you doing here? You will not go out there and hustle. Eh? What does it look like I'm doing? I'm thinking about my life, of course. You're thinking about your life? If I'm beyond. Hey! <laughs> Is it not your mates that are outside there doing something? Why do you sit here doing nothing? Are you not a man, Andy? But I told you before we got married that I don't want to stay in this country. Mm. And what did you say? You have a big house, you have a good car, you have a paying job. We can live happily ever after on your money until I travel abroad. Hey! Isn't that what you said? Hey! I got the now go fair. It's only me bogey. Eh? So what happened after two years? Why didn't you travel abroad? I was trying to get you pregnant, madam. You said I must get you pregnant before I travel. Wasn't that what you said? Eh, uh, eh, uh -huh. I was pregnant uh, before I lost it yesterday. Uh, as usual now. As expected, your mother's former people has taken it again. How are you when? Hey, I was even thinking you are among my mother's former people. Why haven't they taken you? Eh, uh, Andy, what are you still doing here? They should have taken you now. Let me have peace. So you want them to take me, eh? Of course. That will make you happy. This uncle, are you adding any value to me? I'm asking you, are you adding any value to this family? All you do is to sit here and do nothing. My mother will cook, you will eat. Nana will bring money and give you. You'll be adding weight. Nen, Nena, like Stop touching me. Poco, 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 poco. You can talk, but don't touch me again. Because go sit down, eh? If you want respect, go out there and look for money. Don't you have friends? I ask you, don't you have friends to help you? Friends that I'm hiding from. Hey. You want them to know I'm now poor. Hey. Andy. Andy that declares anywhere he goes to. I'm now a beggar. That's what you want, right? And talking about your mother's former people. Have you forgotten that I started liking you since four years ago? Way back before you became the madam with the money that you are just barely two years. That is shocking you. Abogi, Ineko, Madame Istanbul, Madame Toki, you soon be Madame Sardin. Don't worry. You're very stupid, Andy. You're very, very stupid. Go and make money and stop sitting here and be eating our food. If not, if I come out here and see you sitting down here, Andy, I will use this slipper, sir. The kind of beating I will give you. Hey! If you're a responsible woman, you'd have sold this your anklet and given the money to me to travel abroad. Mm -mm. But you won't do that. So, since you can't do that, allow me to think hey. and find a way to tell my uncle in Abuja na ni ma pewa go mazu. Hey, ti cha go. Hey. Nenum, on where's he have phone? Let me see if he will give me small loan to, to, to process my trip to Canada. If ele me wogi. If ele me wogi, you, if you were a responsible man like you said, you would have cut this your dread and give it to those who were selling attachment to give your wife money. Anum pa no, it's me that is going to sell my anklets. Eh? Oh, fire you show what? If you let me bogey, Andy, I will not do it. I will not kill myself for you. I will not. And let me tell you, if I come out here and see you sitting down here, I will use these slippers here and give you the beating of your life. I know, Pama.
owns a restaurant so I spoke to her about us and she said that you can come and work at her restaurant that she will pay you 30,000 monthly and pay me 30,000 monthly and that is about 60,000 there <laughs> hi <laughs> What is it now? Why are you laughing? What is it? 60,000 From me. Alex. Uruni Bonatuku. On a normal day, I dash beggars 100k. 60k is not up to what I spend each time I service my car. I know, but stop talking like this now. Stop talking like this. It's breaking my heart. Stop talking like this now. Stop it. Stop talking like this. You want us to be serving food? What can we do now? Do we have a choice? So what will happen if someone that knows me walks into the restaurant and see Alex? Alex of all people serving food. No, Alex, don't talk like this now. We don't have pride anymore. We don't have pride anymore. We have to do what we have to do to survive. Look at, look at where we live now. We have nothing left. We have to remove our pride and, and do what we have to do to survive. Else, hunger will kill us. Hunger will kill us here. Oh. We, have to, we have to survive. We have to survive. Huh? Forget about your pride. There's no pride in this one. So don't, don't go hungry forever. No, we have to. We have
Um, are you going Fine to... woman. How are you? What are you doing here? Have you been following me? Oh, How did I you just appear here? I wouldn't lie. I've been following you. Right from the restaurant, I've been following you. You're a beautiful woman, you know. Come on. How can I help you? Um, why don't you come in? Let's talk. Come in, let's talk. So, what do you want to talk about? Um, let's go to my house. Uh, I'll give you 500,000. Okay, fine. I'll make it a million. Yeah, I'll make it a million. Okay? Let's go. You're a beautiful woman. Say nothing. I hope you're okay. Relax. I'm a good man. Um, I just um, finished from the construction site and um, I want to quickly get home. I'll step back to work. But trust me, you're not going to regret anything. Okay? I'm a good man. Stop looking at me like that. Here's a millionaire. I just got it from the bank today and thanks gracious. I just got it handy. It's for you. Oh, come on. Come join me. You know, I still um I still have to go to work today. I have to get back to the office today. And I'm sure you have to go back to your auntie's restaurant to continue your work. Did you even hear me? To hell with you and your money. Never. I said never. You will never get me. Yes, I almost wavered and I almost fell for this nonsense. You know, I am a woman that I am. I'm a woman that knows that there is morning and there's evening and they are very far apart. My mother once told me that between morning and evening, a lot of stories happen. And anyone who thinks that their story has ended in the morning has to do a rethink. I will never, and I repeat, I will never do this with you. And don't you ever in your life come close to me again. Do you understand me? Wait. Wait. You know, I've seen a lot of women. But for you, you're one resolute woman. I'm sure you really love your husband, right? Yes, I do. Okay, I want to help him. Tell him to get me his CV. I'm sure you still have my card, right? Just tell him one of the customers at your restaurant requested for his CV. And let me see, I can give him a good job. At least 
that should be able to help the both of you. I'll tell him. Wait. Have the money, it's yours. told me not to tell you that he told me to tell you that he will be going to Abuja tomorrow to see his uncle to get money to go to Canada. I don't understand. <laughs> Andy told you to tell me not to tell me. My what type of jargon is that? He's trying to tell you that Andy confided in her not to tell you that the secret that he's traveling. But in other words, he wanted you to know that he's traveling. For Mama to tell you this. Oh, Do you understand it now? Oh, that yes. kind of husband. Mm. Where they hide things from your wife. I'm mm. traveling in two days, Mama. Not tomorrow. I didn't tell you to. Uh... What's the difference? I ask you. Eh? Make sure that that's Canada you're going. Hmm? If you don't come back on time, if I see husband, I will marry. Nenna Zukwani Ke. That's not how to talk to your husband. Uh-uh. Show some respect. Do you want people to say that Mama did not raise you well? Eh, brother. Don't brother, brother me. Calm down. Oh, yeah. Eat the food. Eh? What type of husband travels without telling his wife? One who is afraid of his wife. Bam! Case closed. Mama. Mama, sorry I woke you. But Mama, I'm worried. I'm worried. Honestly, Mama, I'm not enjoying this life we're living. I'm not. Take a look at where we're staying. I, I know you're used to it, but I'm no longer used to it. I'm not finding it funny. Eh? Mama, look at how I'm reacting everywhere. Everywhere is so hot, I can't even sleep. Mama, please. I want us to, you know, take me to that place. You did that thing. Eh? Because I want to do it myself. Let me do it again. So that everybody will be happy. Nena. Ma? How can you enjoy life when you cannot enjoy life because of the vow? Ha! Mama, leave that one, eh? They vow. They would give me another option now. Hey, don't you think so, Mama? It's not the same thing they tell you that they are going to ask me to do. They can't ask me to go on the streets begging. No, eh? So, Mama, uh, that one shouldn't bother you. Don't change my mind, Mama. Pico, don't change my mind. I'm ready to do this thing. I'm ready, eh? I'm tired of this kind of life. I, I'm not enjoying it. I'm no longer the Madame the Madame, eh? Hi. Mama, I know you're not finding this thing I'm saying funny. I understand, eh? But, Mama, honestly, this is the right thing to do. Look at my brother Alex now. I don't like this kind of life. I don't like it. See, my brother is suffering. He's suffering. I'm not enjoying it. Me too. Mama, look at you. We're supposed to be taking care of you, not living in this kind of place. Mama, please, we have to do this thing. 
and so that everybody will be happy. We'll start enjoying our life, you know, driving cars, money in my account. I'll be the madam, the anywhere I enter. Hey, on a man, you go on a fanny name, doings. Mama Biko, no, no, eh? Please, Mama Biko, I'm begging you. Let's go there. Let's go there and do it. I know that this time everything will be fine. Mother of the wind, this is the living thing we brought to you. Please accept it. <sighs> you shall not carry in your womb or on your knee. Hmm? The cry of a child shall never be heard in your house. Yeah. Do you agree? Ha! Huh. <laughs> mother of the wind, uh, don't worry. My mother will stand in my gap. Eh? She will do the, the same thing she did before. Please. Mama, you will stand in my gap, okay? No way, Nena. Eh? My time of sacrifice has passed. All I want to do now is to take warm soup at night and dream about my late husband when I'm asleep. My time of roaming around the streets is no more. Please, mother of the wind, please don't be angry. Just give me some more time. Let me go and think about it. How can I not carry, how can I not hear a cry of a baby or carry my own child? No, no. Because I'm, I'm begging you, just give me a little time, I'll be back. Take this. <laughs> Try it into a bush. Run away without looking back. Else, you will bear the burden of barrenness. Eh? As you have awoken, the spirit whose work that is. Oh, man. of the wind, please. Can Go! I... Oh, <laughs> Why are you not picking your call? Hmm? It's not an important call. Let me see. Hmm? Give me the phone. It's not an important I call. I said give now. me the phone. Hello? Hello? Fine, give me. Fine, fine, lit. Hello? Hello? Who is this? I told you, I don't know. This person is not important. Why are you, why are you worried about this person? I told you it's not an important phone call. A random man is calling you fine, fine lady on the phone and you're telling me I should not worry about it. Well, it's not an important call. I told you not to worry, yes. I see. So foolish men are now flocking no. around you and you are tolerating it. No. If you don't tell me the truth, I will disfigure your face. Who the hell is this? Fire! Fire!
pick your call. Pick your call. Are you mad? What is wrong with you? Why are you calling me? You're where? You're outside. You're outside, right? Wait for me. What are you doing here? You need to calm down. What are you doing here? I mean, I thought you stop coming here. What do you want from us? What do you want? Listen, stop. Don't ever come here again, even to eat. Don't come here. Don't even come, Seth. We don't want your eating. Do you understand me? You stop out. coming here. What I'll, is it? Go to my auntie's house and open a compound for those dogs to come out and bite you. Do you understand me? It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. Hello. You must be Mr. Alex. Yes. The last time I gave this lady a ride. Sorry, my wife. Oh, your wife? The other day I gave her a ride. She spoke so glowing of you. You know, I have a job for you. And I think you like it. We don't want your job. Do you understand me? We don't, don't want your job. Did I tell you my husband is jobless? Baby, come down. Did I tell you that he's jobless? Baby, we don't want your job. Baby, come down. Do you understand me? Hey. You know, I eat here. I always come here to have my special fish. And I see you speak good English. My friend has a job from a shipping company, and that is what I'm offering you. Please I mean no harm. How available is the job? This job is available. The job is not available. The job is what? It's not available. Baby, Do you understand down, me? Baby, if you take that job, I will divorce you. Eh? I will divorce you. Try it. Try and take the job. Ngozi, what is going on here? Uh, please, I don't want the job. Yes, I'm sorry. I don't want it. Really? Yes, thank you. Job. I mean no harm. No, no, no. We no need them. No worry. We don't need it. Oh God, no verse, no verse, I beg. Go see. He's always coming here. Stop coming here. Okay, stop okay, stop, okay. stop coming to his place. Okay, 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 okay. Dog will bite you. Dog will bite you. Stop coming here. Okay, okay, okay. I beg. No, no verse. Okay, okay. He'll coming here every I time. Why, why are you always coming here? Why? Baby, it's okay. Why are you always coming here? Why? Stop coming why? here. Baby, no okay. sense. That's not picking the warrior. I beg. No verse, eh? I'm, I'm very, very sorry. I have a special fish for you. I spice no, it up with no, crayfish. I lost my appetite. Ah, please, I lost no best. Never mind. You're my biggest customer. Uh, you know what? I was just trying to help. I know. I know. I said he needs the job, and that I was know. why I was trying to help. I'm so what sorry. What are these? Okay. It's okay. I just, I just have to leave. Have what? a good day. You will come back tomorrow, right? Yeah, free test of them all those things. <laughs> Brighto. Wow, <laughs> Thank you, Brighto, but I don't like that statement at all. Why would you say free test of them those days? Are you saying I'm ugly? No, I didn't say that. You are more, you are still fine, even more finer than before. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah. So, so what's the thing you said you want to see me? You say it's a matter of urgency. Yes, that's why I'm here. You know you're my family friend and um, if I tell you anything, you will not judge me. No, no. Are you sure? How can I? Talk to me. Righto. Yeah. I'm ready to be your woman. You know those things you've been saying that you love me, you want me to be your woman? I'm ready. I'm ready to give you all the love. All the love that you've ever wanted. I'm ready. <laughs> yeah? And you're married. You're married. What about him? I better leave that one. No? That thing is not marriage. Eh? I was just managing him. How can you say that man is my husband? And he left me and went to Abuja. He ran away. Oh. He ran away. And he said that from Abuja he's going to Canada. Eh? Right. Oh. You know now, as you said, Nenina, fine girl. <laughs> um, so, I need a man. A man that is capable. Capable of taking care of me. And I know you're capable. That is why I called you, so that you will come. I'm ready. I'm ready to give you all the love, all the love you've ever wanted. I am ready. Just make me your woman. Even if it's your side chick, I don't mind. <laughs> so, what about your brother? He's capable. Alex. 
Alex, Alex, I'm going to go quick. Eh? Alex is broke. Very, very broke. Alex, I cannot even take care of him. Himself and his wife. It's me. Alex can take care of. It's not possible. Wait, 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 wait. I don't really understand. You mean Alex is broke? Ha. Alex is broke. Oh. Alex sells food. You know food. All those restaurants. That is where Alex is working. What? Alex? Hmm. To feed now is even a problem. Are you serious? Alex? Uh, but I told leave Alex now. I called you for us to, you know, talk about ourselves. Leave Alex. Let's let's talk about ourselves. My proposal. Wait, eh? wait, wait. Let me let me really understand you. You mean Alex is working where? Ha. Restaurant. And moreover, hold on. I I don't need to date you before I give you money, okay? So Let's talk about Alex. It's a long story. Oh. Well, you know the person that called Alex to tell Alex that she saw our mother begging? Yes, yes, I did. It's a story for another day. So, is the only water you are drinking. What do you care for? Ah, I don't care for anything. Now, money I care for, don't be water. <laughs> If you give me money, they okay, no buy me anything. Nana. Nana go. Right, so move. You are no, no, no. My guy, Alex. My guy. through all this hell and you refuse to tell no one even your friend we have been friends since secondary school days sometimes a man is not supposed to say what he's going through most people don't care some are even happy you have it so no need well all hope is not lost as a matter of fact there is a, a standing contract that worth 40 million naira at the company I work. They need bitumen, about 30,000 tons. So I want you to stand bid for the job today, today. I appreciate your love as an old friend, but I don't have money to carry out such. Don't worry about the financing. I'm gonna bring someone that will finance it. Yeah? Are you serious? I'm serious. So where do we find bitumen? You find bitumen in Ondo State, precisely at Gabu. Yeah. So please, um, I need you to educate me on this. What is bitumen? What is it used for? Okay. Um, it's about uh, roofing, damp roofing, waterproofing, paints, car parks, runways, or fence treatment, and so on. As a matter of fact, do you know that Nigeria has the second largest bitumen in deposit? And it's about 42.47 billion tons in reserve. What? Yeah. Wow. And this country is broke. 
Come on, Alex. You know you are my guy, you are my brother. You know that. As a matter of fact, this deal is for me. I would have taken it, but I'm giving it to you on a platter of gold. If I wanted it, I would have taken it by proxy. But come on, bro. I want you to bounce back. Man, I'm not happy to see you in this situation. I want you to bounce back, okay? Thank you very much, Bright. I appreciate this. In fact, I'm short of words. Let this work first. Let this work first. And I will truly believe that God's time is the best. By His grace, with faith, it's going to work. Thank you very much. Yeah. God has done it already. <laughs> God has done it already. You need something? No, 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 no. I'm full already. <laughs> <laughs> now sometimes it's good for you to wait for the hands of God. Look at what is happening. Hmm. You uh, can don't it worry. Oh my God, let it happen. Let it work first. Oh my God. I reserve my comment. Yeah. Hey! Tell me the good news. The Lord has done it. He has done it. The Lord has done it. The Lord has done it. He has done it. Tell me, tell me, tell me. What I happened? Seventy-five million naira contract. <laughs> To crown it all, we seal the deal that I will be the one supplying whatever the company needs for one year. Hey! These people are big, they buy stuff every week because they're into construction, they're into college, they're into engineering. Wow! We are made again. Hey! <laughs> hey! 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 Mercy! Almighty God! I thank you! I give you praise! My ancestors, I thank you! Uh, hey! What is happening here? What is happening here? Mama. What happened? Mama, I won 75 million naira contract. Why? <laughs> 75 Mama. million. God has remembered us. God has remembered us. God has remembered us. God has remembered us. 75 oh. million naira contract, Mama. Mama, hell. Oh, God, one more. 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 Oh, this is good news. God has finally remembered us. Hey! 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 So I teamed up with my uncle, we brought in investors, and then we opened a capital investment company. And um, currently we're in about four states in the country. We're doing so well. <laughs> and by next two years, we should be in about 10 states. So I said to myself, what am I going to Canada to do when all I've always wanted, I can make it here in Nigeria? <laughs> if I want to visit Canada, I'll just take a trip with my beautiful wife. We'll visit and come back here. So I decided to come pick my beautiful wife with me to Abuja uh -uh. so we can start a new life together. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. New cars, a new home, and you can now be the madame you've always been. A more comfortable life for you, my dear. <laughs> 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 hey. That sounds good. Brother. Mm -hmm. Surprised at his sudden wealth. <laughs> I mean, he just explained. I mean, just in three months, he has made so much money. Ha! Are you sure your mother did not go somewhere and did something for you? <laughs> no, no, no. When God works, it looks like magic. True. Mm. Yes, it's True. a miracle working God. You can say that again. Just look at us now. From selling pepper soup and beer. Hi. To this life again, just look at how beautiful this house is. And so peaceful. Mm. At least nobody will call me ritualist woman. I'm telling you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so peaceful now. Oh, oh. oh wow. Hi. Oh, okay. Mm. You're very, very lucky.
lucky that you came back on time. If not, I would have gotten married oh. to another man. Yeah. Uh uh. Uh uh. Uh uh. That will happen. I know on time. I don't have time to be waiting for men. Okay. <laughs> This family, the matriarch, the one who dwelled and later found her way back, the one who can now enjoy the fruit of her labor without sacrificing her happiness and life to the enemy. Let's welcome my great mother, Ne of Gazi. You're welcome, Mama. <laughs> Mama. <laughs> we look at you. <laughs> so beautiful. Thank you. Mama, the mama, please sit. Mama. Now you can eat and enjoy your son's money without anything. <coughs> it's a feeble joy. Please eat your chicken. Happiness to be an ace and one for me. Thank <laughs> you. 